Welcome to Fans Matter. <laughs> All right, whenever y'all are ready. Oh, wait, is ready? it on? It's ready. Oh, I... <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Fans Matter. You know, I know. Welcome to Elvis Fans Matter. Uh, uh, I'm nervous because I screwed everything up, you know. <laughs> no, but, uh, uh, you know, I got the complete stutters right now. That's what they call me, stutter bill. The staggering stutters. <laughs> but, anyway, we here, we're going to answer a few more questions and, and a little, a few more little stories, stories and, you know, and just have uh, a little fun. And with that, I'm going to turn it over to the question asker. All right. Um, question that goes along with the, the beginning of this video. It says, was Elvis as silly and fun-loving as Billy? <laughs> yeah, that's, that's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he, he was. He, he was funny, but he wasn't as silly. <laughs> yeah. He used to say, we're all going to be put in the home for the silly. Home for the silly. Home for yep. the silly. That was one of his <laughs> sayings. Yeah. He loved to have fun, and he, he never liked Pardon. to get real serious when he was... No. Um, now, he did get real serious, but I mean, like, he liked to stay on the light side, and, and um, when we would start to get real serious or talking or something he always came up with something crazy to yep. say to kind of break the you know mood and not get down too and, deep you yeah know. don't get down and out and i mean there were times so we got you know some got into some deep real stuff. deep stuff yeah but believe me it was you know it was good too when we did you know yeah. Finally break the, as they say, that break the ice. Mm -hmm. that, you know, come well, you out kind of just like because clear your thoughts and you know that's get everything out and that's like what we, that's a lot of the stuff we did up in his room a lot. We'd just sit around in a circle in the middle of his bed and just kind of you know let it all. all right. <clears throat> uh, just let it all out. Let it all. Let out. all. Well, I ain't gonna say that. Hang I was out. gonna say let it all hang out, and then I was like, uh, you know, that may that may come to some more questions. But so. uh, uh, I don't know. That brings up something, and ooh, I don't know what. Go ahead. Go ahead. I know. Uh, there at the last one night, I was out there, and we were in Lisa's room, and uh, we were talking about the book at Sunny and Red and Dave were doing and uh, he was asking me about certain things, you know, that uh, was in it and all of that. And it got uh, got pretty emotional. You know, Elvis started to, you know, the actor started crying and he said, you know, he said, you know, he said, I don't know why these guys are going to do this <coughs> to me. He said, you know, he said, I would have, I would have hired him back. He said, you know, he said, they, they, and he, you know, he was kind of crying. And, and I said, look, I, I patted him on the shoulder and I said, look, I said, you know, I said, uh, it, it'll all be okay. I said, you know, uh. You know, it's kind of out of revenge and all. I said, you know, and that's what they're doing is, you know, and uh, don't let it hurt you like that. He said, well, he said, you know, he said, I can't help it. Mm -hmm. He said, no, I care for it. And uh, this, this I haven't told. Maybe should, you know. but anyway, we got, you know, that's one time that we had to actually get ourselves like out of the you know the moment because boy it was it was you know getting real you know sad you know <laughs> which I guess is a word to use and so we finally broke the broke the monotony by carrying on you know and, but that's what that's what I'm talking about you know we're, yeah. my Elvis was just like anybody else you know what I mean 
got his feelings hurt. He got his feelings hurt, just like anybody else. And and you know, uh, I I just I just let him go. You know, I just get it, get. That's what I'm talking about. Get it off his chest. Sometimes you, know. you have to if it's built and, up. Yeah. Just let let. And he didn't go. get too serious too many times. Right. You know, uh, uh, he how hit the high. I know, Spots you know, and... with, you know, like, probably with uh, the women he was with, you know, uh, Anita, Priscilla, you know, uh, oh, all, and, uh, all of Linda, uh, Daphne, and, uh, and all that, uh, you know, they had their moments, I'm sure, you know, he released, you know, more right. and all, but... Uh, it, that kind of reminds me too, like that it was on, like the same situation, not the same situation, but it was like his feelings hurt. It's like the woman at the movie. Oh yeah. And you know, he actually, like you said, it hurt him so bad that she would say the things she said to him. That. What happened at the Methian? Yeah, it uh, brought tears to his eyes, and the only way we could get him out of it and and get on a lighter note, you know, we were all saying what all, you know, how, <laughs> what all we could do to her and, um, you know, that she, and he actually wanted to, now th this is how he is. How it started was he had gone to the bathroom and he come out and stopped at the concession stand and, uh. At the Methian. At the Methian. And this woman, you know, she said, you know, she said, uh, you know, she said, you, 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 you give all these things away and said, you know, uh, you come up here and this, and she hasn't even been paid. Talking about her daughter. Talking about, because you know, her daughter was working behind the concession. Okay. And, of course, that was the first lie the woman told because they always paid up front. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anytime we rented the Memphian, mm -hmm. I was paid up front. Okay. Uh, the projectionist and the people, you know, that that the concession mm -hmm. stands and so on, and they, like I say, they were all paid up front. But that was her way. And he said, "Well, he said, he said, I'm, I'm sorry." And 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 uh, he turned. He said, uh, "He, uh, I think it was Al, I believe." He said, "Al," okay. he said, "You know, take care of this real quick." And she said, well, you know, I mean, that, that, it's a, you know, a little late now, I have to remind you, you know, she said, and, and all these people wait on you, she said, my daughter here, she waits on you all the time, get you what you want, and, you know, you don't even pay her no attention. He said, ma'am, he said, I'm sorry. He said, you know, I just, uh, he said, you know, I, I just come up here, you know, to more or less get a Coke, and I'll, he said, you know, my staff takes care of stuff like that. He said, I don't. She said, well, you give everybody all these cars and all this kind of, I mean, just a sarcastic real, boy. Real bitch. And mm -hmm. I, I, I had to hold my mouth, Joe and everybody else around them, when we had to hold our mouth mm -hmm. because in our situation, it, if we had done something, it would have fell on Elvis, right. not us. Wow. I mean, if I, you know, slapped the, and I would have liked to, uh, you know, and I don't mean. He would have had the lawsuit. He, he would have had the lawsuit. Right. And and sitting here and hit, I mean, he just, you know, uh, he said, well, I, I'm sorry and all that. And, and he said, you know, you, you're not being very nice. And she said, well, you, you're not very nice either. In fact, you, you know, you're fat. And yeah. God, that just, what? She said that. You could yeah. see the blood just drain. He went white, and he said, "Well, he said, you know, he said." I said, "You are too." <laughs> he said, "You know, he said, I, I'm, I'm sorry you feel that way." He said, "But you know, he said, I, I you know, I, I can't listen to this." And mm -hmm. he just turned and walked on down. That's it. Got his stuff. Got up. We went out the back way, we got in the car, and me and Joe and Linda and Elvis. And, he, and that's another time he was tearing up. Tears, you know. yeah. God, he I, said, I he couldn't always stand it. What did I, he said, what did I do? He said, you know, he said, I never thought about the woman, you know, 
wanting a car or anything like that. He said, you know, he said, he looked back at me, he said, Billy, he said, when we get home, he said, and we were in that Cadillac, that yellow Cadillac, he said, take this back and give it to that, to that woman, that girl. I said, not in your lifetime of mine. I said, I wouldn't carry that bitch nothing. <laughs> I said, she don't deserve nothing. I said, if she'd have went about it a little bit different, I said, yeah. I said, but no, you can get somebody else to take it, but I sure as hell won't. Mm -mm. And I don't think you ought to give her a damn thing. Mm -mm. I said, you know, she don't deserve anything. Anybody yeah, that rude and that, you know, bold to come out and say the things she said, I said, she don't deserve it. I'm just... We were yeah. we were starting to try to get it because he was really boy. really upset. Ooh, that was mad. And uh, Linda was saying no, uh, but she but, called him but, but no, she doesn't deserve it. You know, you you did nothing uh, to offend her. I mean, you know. And I was saying, and I and I remember him starting to laugh. I said, Yo. <laughs> I said, what she needs is splinters drove up under each fingernail. <laughs> and he started, he went, damn, Joe. I said, I mean, And I Linda, said, you know, Linda, Linda was saying, say, yeah. no, you don't need to give her nothing. She, she don't deserve it, you know. She, and she had pet him and, and said, so buttons it, you know. We got home, we got to it. Graceland and went upstairs and <laughs> He got up on top of the bed walking, and he was, you know, and just she. Then we had him into it. She needs this. I should have done. It. I would, you know, this. She hurt, you know. That there was no, and we were going, yeah, yeah, you know, she needs this and she needs that and she don't need this. And he was snarling and walking, and he was, you know, just mad. Then he stopped all of a sudden, and he was looking. He went. Damn, I'm a good-looking son of a bitch. Because he was looking in the mirror behind the bed. <laughs> and Linda said, you are. You sure are. <laughs> and Billy, and that's when Billy said it was funny. Billy said, Now, that yeah. was later. That, that was it? I thought that, that was the same time. Uh-uh, no, that was later. <laughs> <laughs> but that, that got him out of it, you know. We, uh, he yeah, and he just and yeah, started laughing. We started laughing at him, you know, and... and it finally got him tickled. Of course, we were. Because he was thinking. You know, we weren't think. We just said all that stuff to get him. You know, I wouldn't. No, I meant what I said. I'd <laughs> like to have slapped that heifer. I, I mean, you know, I, what was her daughter I'm not doing? A woman the, her abuser, daughter was working. But, you know, that woman the, deserved to be uh, um, concession stand. But I mean, was her daughter? To by her, her daughter was not saying a word. Was not saying a word. Her so daughter was, was embarrassed to more, death. I was going to say, you think that yeah. embarrassed the daughter? Her, her daughter was embarrassed oh. to death, and you know. The reason the woman did it, I'm sure, is because it had been in the paper about Elvis giving cars <laughs> and doing all this, and she figured, oh, we'll get a, you know, I, I, I come up there and say something, and he'll give up, give her one or give me one, and mm -hmm. it didn't turn out that way. She no. got more than I mean, <laughs> I don't know if uh, I mean she, she meant got to get Elvis's or, attention. Yeah, you know, she did. And uh, like I say, she the she more did. she talked. Uh, the worse she got, you know, yeah. and and the more she criticized him, and uh, anyway, that's whoop, get that get was, out of that. That, crap, was a, that makes me want to steal if I can I find it. <laughs> Forces to bend over and kick, find her, find her head, and that way I can kick her ass. <laughs> that's horrible. <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. Another question: Why did Elvis always seem to wear long sleeves? Like no matter the season, his his uh, for concerts or when he was seen, he had long sleeves. Did he have a thing of just not liking short sleeves? Did he have a reason? Did he ever say? No. Uh, he just didn't like. He it. had skinny arms, and he didn't. Yeah. No. Oh, did I was no. like, okay. No. <laughs> no, I don't know. It just that was it just was, Elvis, you know. He, it, it was a thing like with his collar always turned up. Yeah. He didn't like. He thought his neck was long and he and That's skinny, skinny. Yeah. and he didn't like it. And and he would turn his collar up to take off. And he and he wore long. Now you will see him every once in a while in a short sleeve shirt, yeah. but not in some pictures. Just but, just depend on what he wanted. Yeah. Dress. I've seen yeah. him come out 
and the summer town with a coat on. A fur you know. Right. <laughs> that's about like Laney where it being 100 degrees when school starts yep. in August and she's wearing hoodies and a hoodie and a jean and jeans for... Elvis was like uh, whatever he liked. It didn't matter the season, you know. Uh -huh. Used to, and now it's gotten back to that. The the dress that pe they wear, whatever. Used to, if it was winter, you weren't on TV with a short sleeve shirt. Mm -hmm. You had, you know. But now mm -hmm. the everybody wears the sleeveless and mm -hmm. everything. It doesn't matter. Or you didn't wear a certain color shoes before. What Labor Day or whatever it was? Yeah, I can't you, remember. You can't. Couldn't it, wear white you shoes. You couldn't wear white <laughs> shoes or white pants. I think it was white pants after Labor Day mm -hmm. and all that. I don't like white pants. And I didn't know that back then because I had I, I wore, pair of white shoes. I wore just about all the time. I always just yeah, wore whatever I wore. Yeah, I was like, you're not supposed to wear them up until East. You can't. Wear, you used to could. You weren't supposed to wear white shoes until after Easter. Uh, yeah. And then white pants you couldn't wear after Labor Day. You didn't wear them now. At all. I mean. And you didn't mix brown and black. I well, mean, now you you, you, do, you do. Well, or you can. Uh, you know, I, I always if I liked it, I I yeah. didn't care where it I came from or done. what. No, you know, I, if I liked it, I've I always liked done it. what I've wanted to do. But anyway, <laughs> all right. So there was not. I mean, there was no particular no, reason. No, he no, just no. he that just liked long choice. sleeves better than short sleeves. All right. Um, do you know what company in Texas did the customization for the Lisa Marie plane? I remember when we went to see the plane uh, before it was That's finished. That's a good question. You know, I don't. Remember. I don't remember either. But do you remember going to? Oh gosh, uh, yeah. We we flew out there on uh, a Learjet. Uh, yeah, uh, Jack Adams Learjet. Uh huh. And uh, he was uh, Jack Adams was uh, the one he bought the ranch from. He mm -hmm. was the owner of uh, Holiday Inn. Yeah. Okay. So he had, he had borrowed Jack Adams. I remember Lee you, out there. you, me, Elvis, Linda, and Sonny mm -hmm. flew out uh, to Texas. Mm -hmm. Was it Dallas or? No, Fort Worth. Fort I think, Worth. If I, remember right. I can't remember what, what, we went so many places. I, I, I one, never knew what. One looked like the other, you know. <laughs> the garbage dumpsters in the back <laughs> going in and out. <laughs> But yeah, we we flew out there, but I don't remember. It was only half there. finished when he when we went to see it. it was uh, he, yeah, we went inside and you could see the wiring, you know, uh -huh. where, they, you know uh, where they had started stripped everything out. Yeah. And stuff. It was uh, it was fascinating. It was even more fascinating when they finished oh, it. Oh yeah, golly! Boy. I mean that that uh, being on that was like. Home in the sky. The oh my house. goodness! Yeah. You just and the way it was laid out and everything. You know, it was like it's just like a house, just like a plush house, <laughs> plush yep. nice mansion in the sky. We have uh, one more question, and then I guess we'll wrap this one up. Um, it says, "Was Elvis afraid of the dark? Did he?" Like when he slept, was it dark or did he he need? He Jimmy didn't... was afraid of the dark. <laughs> what? Who? <laughs> there was a country song that come out uh, and it was about a little girl. That, he was know, afraid of the dark. Was afraid the dark. Of the dark. I don't think something. he was afraid of the dark. He no. just didn't like it. Pitch dark, I don't think. And. He liked it ice cold in his room. I know yeah, that. I have a night light on every night, and it's for me. I'm. I don't like to wake up and it be pitch we, dark. We I have our TV on all night. We don't. I don't ever turn it off. No, he yeah. wasn't. Uh, but he wasn't, he wasn't afraid. afraid of I don't really know of anything he was afraid of. Um, well, he, he. He, he what? Oh, uh, believe it or not, Elvis was uh, afraid to fly in his younger days. Oh, well, days. yeah, in his he, younger days. Elvis got over certain things that he was uh, scared of. Yeah. And flying was one of them. Yeah, I, I knew that. He didn't like to fly at all. Took a train most of the time, you know, or drove. And uh, But, you know, as he got older and all, uh, he when he was a uh, teenager, he, he didn't like to eat uh with anybody, with else? anybody else's, you know, uh, utensils. Utensils. He carries on his Carry back. Carry your design. Yeah, yeah I, mean, I he, mean, in general. He had what? What do you call that? A phobia. 
Yeah, yeah uh, he had a it, phobia like a germ about phobia. germ phobia. Mm -hmm. and, and then, you know, he got out of it, you know. As he got older. As he got older and got, you know, uh, to be famous for, you know, he got over a lot of things. I could feel that, though, with everything going around. Oh, well, now, yeah. Now, yeah. Now, back yeah. then, but you back, know, yeah. he didn't, uh, you didn't hear about every, it wasn't in, stuff in like In fact, he would, uh, he would, he would tell us, you know, about how it used that he was a germaphobic boy. He, I mean, it had everything had to be spotless, and you know, and he, he was like that. Well, Everybody you know, you you think about it, and you think about like I do still. Uh, certain times, I'll take sanitizer mm -hmm. and at a restaurant and put it on my fork and spoon and knife and whatever. I mean, you just think about how many times. Those forks have yeah, been but in that, somebody that, else's mouth. That wasn't a phobia. That's nutty. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> nutcase. <laughs> I thought she'd hit me on that one, but she didn't. <laughs> I'm going light on you today. <laughs> All right, good. All right. I think with that, we'll wrap this one up, and yeah. we have plenty more questions. Yeah. I'm gonna look online. For Even more questions. of a nutcase here is think about money. That that is disgusting. <laughs> you think, yeah. that's bad. think about how many times money's been touched. It, oh, it's yes. lady. Money, lady. You're right. That's the most. Hello, YouTube. Believe me. <laughs> it is uh, all your favorite. While COVID was going on, um, money. That's probably free. how. That's probably. I would take whatever change I got and bills and all. Wipe it down and wipe, wipe it, it down. down. With you ever see pennies on the ground and they're just covered in crap? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, they just stay on the ground. I'm a penny. I'm a miser. When it's stuck to the, <laughs> whenever it's stuck to the ground, that, that's when you leave the coin. <laughs> I don't. I pick it up. Papa and pry, it off. He pries it up. <laughs> <laughs> all right. But all right. with that, with, with that, that, this is our Lanny Kate, our great granddaughter, and she's uh, and one. one of our <laughs> brightest. She is. She's <laughs> Ooh, <longer>. twins. <laughs> I know you are not talking. <laughs> with that, with that, right. folks. What do we say, Lady Kate? All the fans, fans matter. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Thanks for watching.